How you keeping folks? Welcome back to Joe Duffy Volkswagen North Dublin. Today we have this stunning ID4 in stock. I'm going to bring in a walk through the car guys to show you some of the features on it and how they work. As you can see here we have our 19 inch metallic alloys. Okay coming around to the boot starting off. Very easily to access just underneath here. Lightly and easily we can lift up. As you can see there's plenty of space. The rear seats will fall down as far as the front seats if you need to make some extra room. Just underneath here you'll have a little storage department for holding your um, your charging cables. Both sides have the boot light. You also have the 12 volt cigarette lighter for any electrical appliances. You also have your parcel shelf so now onlookers can look through the back window and see any of the goods which are in the boot. Now coming into the back seats. See we have the half cloth, half leather interior. Both sides have the children's eyes are fixed space. In the centre here this will flick down. You have two cool polars and if you need to access the boot while the car is driving, pull down here and access the boot. In the centre here we have our rear air conditioning system. So we can adjust the temperature different in the rear to the front if needs be. We also have two USB charging ports. Both sides have the electric windows. And then when the curtain is pulled back you'll have the full display of the panoramic sunroof. Here we have our media display. I'm going to briefly run through this, but when you come in to view the car, we'll show you in great detail how they all work and make sure you don't leave unsure of anything. For your climate controls, we have this button here. For our heated seats, we can press this, this, and also the heated steering wheel on this model, which is a nice feature. If you want to change our mode of driving, we click here. We have Ego Comfort or Individual. We also have our Park Assist options here. Down here we have our key wireless charger and also two cup holders. And in the centre here we have our phone wireless charger, two USB charging ports and a little storage area. And if you don't need to use this, you can nice and neatly hide it. Now coming up to the multifunction steering wheel, on the left hand side we have all our controls for the adaptive cruise control. And on the right hand side we have our voice activation control and all our controls to change the display of the instrument cluster in front of us here. To pull back the curtain, we just slide like this. And that will go right down as far as the back. We also have our SOS button here. So if in case you're having an emergency, press this button, it will call emergency services. To the right of the steering wheel, we have our light controls. So if it's on automatic at night time, it will automatically turn on, and in daytime it will turn off. We also have the heater in the front windscreen and the rear windscreen. And here we have all of our controls for the electric windows and mirrors. With all that said, if you have any further questions or inquiries, please don't hesitate to give us a call as we look forward to seeing you all soon. Thank you.